This is the final week. The finale to the beef sticks. Here we go. And we're ending, we're ending big. We're ending with basilisk. Let's talk about what a basilisk is. Narrator? The basilisk is a legendary reptile reputed to be the serpent king, capable of killing with a mere glance. Descriptions vary from region to region, but according to the Naturalist Historia of Pliny the Elder, the basilisk is a small snake, measuring about 12 fingers in length, or 4.5 feet. And it is so venomous that it leaves a wide trail of deadly venom in its wake. According to Pliny, the basilisk's weakness is the odor of a weasel which was thrown into the basilisk's hole. This quite possibly was inspired by accounts of snakes like the cobra and its natural predator, the mongoose. The real life ingredients to this basilisk is uh, alligator and beef. Salt flavorings, uh, citric acid, dextrose, brown sugar. Okay. So it might be another sweet one. There's a lot of sweet ones in here. So let's see what a basilisk is. I'm a little, I'm a little iffy on this. Like, this is one of those creatures that are, aren't really pretty. But then again, some of the pretty ones weren't really that good either. So here we go. Basilisk. It's chewy. More probably the chewiest one yet. And as I eat it. There's a spice. I can't put my finger on it, but it. This is what I expect basilisk to taste like for sure. But uh, mm, seven, seven out of ten. It's good, but that unknown taste is kind of strange. Like. I don't, what the, whatever that spice is, it's too much. Yeah. I'm finished with it, I agree. 7 out of 10, 100%. It's too salty, I think. There's a little bit too much pepper in it, in that one. I think that's what kills it for me. That's it for that review. We thank you for watching. We hope to see you on the next one we do. If there's anything in particular you want us to try as far as food goes, as far as um, reviews like what we're doing here, feel free to tell us down in the comments. We love to we love to hear what you guys have to say. Thanks for joining us on this culinary adventure that I, I tend to go through. So thanks guys. Till next time, we want you to stay nerdy, stay sexy, always.